so we have Shan today from QSC and we're going to talk about hybrid workspaces. Uh, so thank you, Shan, for speaking to us. Thank you for having me. Thank you. Uh, we'd like to start with a brief about, uh, you know, companies re-evaluating their meeting spaces. How can they entice employees back into the work office? So companies need to create flexible spaces and motivate employees in the office to promote spontaneous collaboration, engagement, and interaction. To do so, the design and configuration of meeting spaces takes a whole new meeting. The office is now the new offsite, and companies must adapt their collaboration spaces to ensure employees are effective and productive when they come to the office. So these spaces need to be equipped with modern technology for on-site and remote participants to effectively collaborate. That means we need to remove friction for human interactions and create spaces where everyone can participate so new views and opinions can be heard. And this is where the high impact space comes in. Okay, so can you tell us about the high impact space? How can it uh, facilitate productivity and engagement? QSIS defines high impact spaces as rooms where end users must achieve substantial, well-defined outcomes and are highly visible spaces such as the visible rooms, boardrooms, executive spaces, training rooms, and, and auditoriums. They include several combinations of advanced characteristics. They're impactful, scalable, and sophisticated meeting spaces that employ professional grade AV and control platforms that integrate seamlessly with collaboration platforms to automate and elevate experience for those on-site as well as as an inclusive hybrid experience for those offsite. The ultimate goal is to reduce complexity for end users, making technology user friendly, offer flexibility, simplicity, automation, improved supportability, and standardization. Okay. So in terms of technologies used in um, high impact spaces, how are they different from those used in legacy spaces? High impact spaces provide the flexibility to support a variety of engagements that often require feature sets, including multi-zone audio, video distribution, and room automation, such as automatic camera switching. Allowing all team members to hear and be heard properly is a high priority goal. So features, features of high impact spaces such as automatic camera switching and beam forming ceiling microphones help eliminate throwaway spaces at the far ends of meeting rooms. It also removes friction for human interaction from hybrid meetings and draw on-site users away from the workplace uh, proximity bias. So the goal is to create an environment for an effective, effective collaboration experience for all. Okay. <laughs> so in terms of the market potential for these kind of collaboration uh, experiences, what do you think is the market potential for these solutions? So Frost and Sullivan's research showed us that approximately two thirds of organizations plan to modify their use of office spaces to accommodate high, uh, hybrid and uh, remote work. Okay. And they will deploy high impact spaces in three different scenarios. The first one is when an office moves, meeting spaces in the new premises will be configured to a much higher standard. Many as high impact spaces. This is significant because so many organizations are looking to reduce their real estate due to the increase of uh, work from home practices. Fewer but nicer offices is the current mantra that we keep hearing. Um, secondly, when existing buildings are renovated and building works need to take place anyway, yeah. organizations will deploy high impact spaces. And then finally, uh, many legacy spaces will be converted on a rolling basis when it's time to upgrade their equipment. Every six years, we think, is a good estimate of how often organizations upgrade meeting spaces on average. Okay. How is QSIS an uh, ideal ABC solution when it comes to providing these kind of collaboration experiences? So, QSIS is an open-based platform built on standard IT protocols. It includes audio, video, and control capabilities in one software-based foundation. We also have a comprehensive uh, portfolio of native software and hardware, and an ecosystem of partners to help create effective collaboration for high-impact spaces. Okay. Uh, thank you, Shan, for speaking to us. Nice having you, having you with me. us today. Pleasure. And uh, we look forward to speaking to you in the future as well. Thank you. Thank you very thank much. You.